Kruken Power Station is a vessel pump storage hydro plant. What that means is that when there's excess electricity on the UK network, we can absorb that electricity and pump water up into a reservoir behind us. And that allows us to then generate when demand is higher across the UK to meet the system demands. Kruken 2 is our project to expand the, the power station and create up to an extra 600 megawatts of power. That will enable more intermittent renewable generation to come onto the UK electricity system such as wind and solar and make sure we've got continuity of supply when we need it. So it's been great to see the reaction of visitors when they come in and they find out that we've got this proposal for expansion. I think everyone's very aware of the government's targets for net zero and they all think it makes such sense to use our existing natural resources in Scotland when they discover that there's no plans to expand the dam, but we are able to construct this whole new underground world, a second hollow mountain as you like. They can't see any reason why we wouldn't do it. They think it makes perfect sense to enable Scotland's journey towards net zero by using the existing landscape and creating this second power station. To be quite honest, the first time you went down the tunnel, you were a wee bit apprehensive, you know, were saying, what am I getting myself in for here, you know? But once you get working there, you th never thought about it, it was just another job, you know? I'm Ian McLean, and uh, I started here in Crewe in 1962 up till 66. Uh, I was a joiner, and we did the shuttering for the concrete work down in the machine hall. Yes, I think it'll be good because, as I say, it'll, There'll be a lot of young people coming up who'll get trades and, well, get work that they would never, ever get the chance of in this area, you know. And it'll, I think it'll, it'll be good for the area, yeah. The project brings substantial benefits to the local area. It provides employment opportunities for local people uh, from Dalmally, Lockhart, across to Owen. So directly over 150 people to 300 people employed during the construction and further opportunities during um, its operation. But also over 900 jobs across the supply chain uh, during construction, me meaning substantial benefits to the region and to Scotland. Subject to a mechanism from the UK government, Kruken 2 could be operational by 2030. I think it's definitely an exciting time to be at Drax. Um, the development of Kruken 2 will require a lot of people with a lot of specialist knowledge and it'll be good to be able to learn from them and be part of the process. It's been a really good opportunity. So I, I did uh, two years at college and followed by three years at uni. So I've been able to apply what I'd learned at uni uh, through kind of working on outages and learning from other engineers on site. It's been a, an experience that you can't really teach, you can't be taught that through education. The expansion of Kruken can only be a positive thing as it creates many more job opportunities for graduates like myself, which means that many more people can have the opportunity that I had. The Kruken extension is, is a really exciting project and one that's really important for Scotland. It brings together a number of our really important skill sets, so civil engineering works, but also that electrical engineering um, skill set too. What we really want to see is to, to a renewables industry that's thriving but also driving economic gain in Scotland. And let's not forget that hydro and pump storage hydro has been part of Scotland's energy story for over a hundred years and particularly Kruken which is incredibly unique and special um, within the landscape and I'm really looking forward to see the next hundred years and what something like pump storage hydro is going to contribute to the system going forward. We are very excited to be bringing this project forward and entering a new phase of the, the possible construction. It brings a lot of benefits to the UK system operator at National Grid and being able to control supply and demand across the UK. And for the local community here, it means investment, you know, significant investment, not just in, in the local community, but across Scotland and the wider UK. Drax is aiming to be a leader in UK dispatchable renewable energy generation and Kruken 2 is at the heart of that project.